Nice, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. You look so handsome, well, by the way. You're not so bad yourself. I mean, Thank international you model. Much. Hello. Well, you know, I had my moments. Now I'm an international actor or international something. Whatever you want to call me. International man of mystery? Sure. I'm not that mysterious, though. I'm, I'm an open book, really, is what it comes down to. An open book? Tell me about that. You know, I mean, I think that um, the best way to walk through this world is just by being vulnerable and authentic, and it's the, you know, the easiest way to attract that type of energy into your life. And, you know, I mean, it's just, it's what feels good. It's what feels right. So, Speaking it's working out for me so far. being vulnerable and open, tell us about your role in this movie. My character's name is Freddie Mitchell. He's a quirky, fun, kind of wacky guy who's just very comfortable in his own skin and uh, ends up falling in love with one of our lovely leads, Calais Stewart, right here. Stunner. She, I mean, please, and just wait till you see the movie. She is phenomenal. Huge, I'm a huge Calais fan. Huge Calais fan. Yeah, we have a, I mean, I think that that is the perfect example of what I was saying before about authenticity and vulnerability is that these two characters um, really know themselves, really um, have a very strong sense of, uh, of self-awareness and really put that out in the universe and end up receiving it back and the love that they find in each other. It's a very unexpected love, but it works. What do you mean an unexpected love? It's a very dynamic relationship and it's important. Freddie is bisexual and I think, he, you know, he always end, uh, thought he would end up with a man and then he ends up meeting Nell, played by Calais Stewart and she sweeps him uh, you know just like just uh, just steals his heart in the first moments of meeting and it's 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 you know straight out the gate just true love from there did you learn any personal life lessons on life and love and playing this role? Um, I learned to set aside judgment. I think that there's a lot of judgment around bisexuality, especially in men. I think that women have the freedom to uh, be uh, physically affectionate with each other, or even experiment sexually, sexually with each other, but not necessarily be put in a box as gay, whereas men don't really have the freedom in today's society and our culture to be free and um, you know, vulnerable or loving or um, affectionate with each other, and I think it's it's a really dangerous story that we've been telling for so many years now that it's not okay when it is okay. I think that you know, even I had to get over the stories that I've been told for so many years of a bisexual man who can actually be bisexual and be attracted to both to both both genders. And it's a crucial time for a platform for a relationship. Yeah. This dynamic. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it was the easiest thing in the world. Honestly, I mean, I, uh, every scene I have with Calais from the moment that I met her, I can see so easily how it really is just about the soul that you fall in love with. It's, you know, gender doesn't really mean much at the end of the day. Are you in love? I'm deeply in love, yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Are you in love? I am in yes. love. Yes. And I'm loving yes. Did it take you 10 dates? It took me a lot longer than 10 dates. Really? It did. All right. All right. It took, it took about five years. Ooh. What, with the same person? <laughs> Wow, okay, no it's judgment. It's complicated. You know, and I think that's the best thing about this movie is that all of these characters are looking for love and it really, uh, they are all trying to get to the same end final destination, but they all go about it in very different ways and it just opens the door of conversation of like, you know, what works for you may not work for me, but at the end of the day, we all just want to be loved. Amen. It was Amen. a pleasure talking to you. you Have as fun well. tonight. Thank you.